looking through the boat, we're in the very aft of the boat. This is the master's cabin. Walking forward, we've got an ensuite in the master cabin, aft head. Master's cabin is pretty big. Got a keel bearing in this hole here. Prop shaft goes in here. This is like a walk in wardrobe anywhere. You can also have a nav station in here. Engine room in here. You've got the galley goes in this section here. Saloon in here. Maybe double bunk in here. And another double bed in here. It's a step down. And this is the forward head. Don't quite know what we're going to do with that room just yet. It could just be a storage room. It could be, you know, the captain's quarters. You could have a bed in there and then storage on one side. And then there's a bulkhead with a little bit of room bit further past that bulkhead there. There's lots of natural light coming in through the windows. However, thinking about extending these windows, making them bigger. There's a huge skylight up the top. Some areas in this boat that need to be fixed is, as you can see here, someone's decided to weld in galvanised steel plate against normal steel here. The issues we're going to have here is galvanic corrosion between the two dissimilar metals. This one is more noble, so this one won't corrode faster than this. The base steel will sacrifice itself before the galvanised steel. It's just a lot safer just to have the two same metals welded together. Uh, this, this will cause minor issues in the future. Previous owners have done the same thing where they've stuck galv on here. Um, that's, that's not great. The welds are going to corrode at a faster rate than it would do if that was steel. That's only one mil thick as well. I'm a little bit worried that you know the chains are going to come up here and they might rub on this. You know, one mil thick, that's not going to last very long. We want the same thickness as what's on the deck here. And we've got stainless against gav against steel. It's three dissimilar metals. There's going to be a corrosion problem. So we're going to fix that up.